All right, so I just purchased this uh, Skinny Pop popcorn. It's organic. I just picked it up at Costco, and I'm sitting in my car with it right now, and we're going to eat some right now. So this is non-GMO, gluten-free, no artificial ingredients, 39 calories per cup. Um, I don't know how that stacks up against other popcorns, but yeah, this is, they call it Skinny Pop, I guess, it's because it's supposed to be good for you. But it's popcorn, and popcorn's generally pretty good. Um, what, what can we see on the back? So, yeah, they, they have this little thing about it. We believe in snacking without compromise, blah, blah, blah. Um, cleanest and good tasting, etc., etc. So here's the nutrition info. Calories, 150 per serving, 14 servings per container. So this whole bag counts as 14 servings, 150 calories each. Um, what else? All right, so it's, it's got your trans fats, your sat, or no, zero trans fats, but it's got a little bit of saturated fat, not a whole lot. Um, total 10 grams of fats, no cholesterol, but it's, it's got plenty of sodium, which is kind of not surprising. Um, got some carbs in there, dietary fiber, insoluble fiber. Um, probably not the best thing for keto unless you were to just only eat like a very little bit of it. Um, it's got some protein in there and not a whole lot of vitamins except for potassium and uh, actually it's got I yeah so iron and potassium. So there you go. Let's take a look at the inside. So I just opened this and uh, so this is the bag and um, kind of at an awkward angle here. but this is how much you get inside the bag, which is actually it looks like there's almost nothing in there, but this is actually you know maybe about, you know, a little less than 50% full. It's like all air, but that's true of like basically any popcorn or potato chips that come in a bag like this. So like if I were to, you know, compress this down, it's still this much, right? Out of this whole bag. And you can pretty much feel how much is in there when you pick it up. So it's not like misleading or anything. But yeah, this is what you get inside. Um, yeah, it's just popcorn, not super exciting or anything. Well, besides that, it's delicious. Let's give it a try. Um, I'm not going to record myself eating this, but I'm going to tell you what I think of it. All right. So it's pretty plain. Um, tastes like just plain popcorn. Yeah. Very, very plain tasting. Daddy. Daddy. Lightly salty. Um, which I guess is why the salt content is listed on there. Let's take a look at the back again. Um, did they list actual, all right, so ingredients, this is what we really want to see. So it's organic popcorn with organic sunflower oil and sea salt. It's not incredibly salty, but probably about just right. Um, I wouldn't really want it to be more salty than this. The salt level is enough that it's probably not going to make you super thirsty, but it's not going to hurt to have some water around, but it's slightly salty. Um, I guess it has some sun, sunflower oil. But as far as I could tell, it tastes like it's not buttered or anything. Obviously, it's not butter, but it doesn't taste like a complete butter substitute. It's not like saturated in the fat. So it's pretty light in terms of fat as far as I can tell. But it tastes like really plain popcorn with a little bit of salt on it, which is, I guess, why they have the name Skinny. It doesn't have a ton of extra stuff on it. It's pretty good. I mean, if you like popcorn and you don't care about having loads of like butter sat covering, like, you know, if you don't want it drenched in butter and you don't want like sugar or anything, then this is probably the popcorn for you. Look at this. This is delicious. It's basically just plain normal popcorn and uh, that's it. So yeah, if that's your your thing, check a, check for a link in the description. I'm gonna try to put something in there. If I can find somewhere you can buy this online. I bought this at Costco, but I'm gonna see if I can find a link to it. Maybe I'll just link to it on Costco if I can do that. If not, I'll put like an Amazon link or something. Check the link in the description. Now, you wanna give me a thumbs up, uh, hit that subscribe button for more content like this in your feed and leave a comment down below if you know something that I didn't mention. Um, thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next video. Daddy?